YouTube. It's your girl Ashlyn from Ashlyn Jaheem, and we back with another video. And who are you? Grace. To the camera. Behind her brother. Okay, you're being too weird for me. Anyways, today's vlog is gonna be a cooking vlog. What are we cooking? Tell the folks. I just told you. Rough tail dip. Okay, you want to show them our ingredients? The meat, for starters. Um, we both got like a little bit of cheese left in here. In this tiny bag of cheese. Um, we're going to go ahead and brown up the meat in this pan. And before we start that, these are our seasonings. Black pepper. Black powder onion powder, a little bit of salt, herb blend. Let's get browning this meat, period. So, to make it easier on browning the beef, you have one of these, so you can smash this thing. It will make your life 10 times easier. You wanna brown the meat? Just mush it up. Once it gets like a little bit like not clumped together, we'll start seasoning the meat. And once it starts browning a little bit. We're gonna season the meat now with black pepper. So, with our salt that gives people high blood pressure. We're going to do a little bit of this. I say a little bit now. Cut off a lot. So, Reese, give me your hand. Our hands are clean. I'm going to put a little bit of salt in your hand. Mm -hmm. Show how much salt is in your hand. That. Put all of it in your hand. Now show them how much is in your hand. So now take your finger and go. That's how much salt we're putting in there. Now you just and then you rinse your hands off. Give that a mixy mix. Some of this garlic powder. To me, garlic powder and onion powder go in everything. And then hold it like this and just shake it. Yeah. This, the Kinder's buttery and garlic herb, we're only putting a little bit of this. I'll use three all seasoning. Not too much. And then we're gonna mix this up one more time. I'm gonna let you keep doing This tool is really easier than using like a actual regular spatula. It actually grounds up the meat really good. He's how old are you? Two. We gonna teach him how to cook today. Just a little bit. Cause we ain't trying to burn down the house. So our meat is almost done and soon we'll have to drain out all the grease. Normally I would typically use the crock pot, but this pan is big enough to make rotel in it. So we're just gonna basically like a one pot meal kind of, just uh, dirtying up a whole bunch of dishes. Now we're gonna strain the beef. Oh my. Thank <laughs> you. 
So now it's draining. All the grease is gonna go in here. Then we're gonna rinse out the pan. While I was off camera, I queued up the cheese that's gonna go in here along with the real tail dip. It's gonna go in here and maybe a little bit of those seasonings along with this triple cheddar. That little bit of cheese and we got some more in the fridge. I probably might not use this other thing of cheese. So we're probably gonna just set that there and then throw everything in here. Clop of sour cream and a teeny splash of heavy whipping cream. A bit more of garlic, onion powder. Then cover and let the cheese melt. And once it melts, mix it all together and I'll come back with the final result. This is what it should look like when it's all mixed together and everything. And then now I'll show you how to plate it. Take some of the chips, put them on a the plate, you know, spread them around. Like this. Then take a scoop. Normally, I would have Doritos. It just tastes better. And then, boom. You got some old damn tail. This is what it looks like. But that plate's for Jaheim, and he doesn't like too much. He just likes it plain and simple. I'll add, like, some sour cream or guacamole. Bomb. But... That is it for today's cooking vlog. Reese lived, like, he just left mid-vlog, so. But, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video. I think I found her. She